right guys, let's take a look at Rookie Racer, see what has changed here for today's construction update. In Ellis's previous videos, you may have noticed that uh, there are some footers being poured over there. Well, it was what, looking to take shape and whatnot, and I'll go up to the exit bridge of Boston to get a better view of it. But as you can see, we have uh, what looks to be like a bulldozer or something way out there doing something. And there was also a cement truck here earlier this morning, but that to my knowledge has been moved to a different area and might have been out of the park honestly because the bulldozer thing is moving away from the construction site. And uh, it looks like none of the track has been put in place yet and uh, it seems like I think very soon we might be seeing construction let's ride go vertical. So let's go take a look at the progress from Boss's exit bridge. We got another view of the construction equipment over here and uh, that was Boss you guys might have just heard and uh, saw some worker over there doing something but I'm not sure what. Let's go a little bit closer to see what we can find. So anyway, I don't recall seeing uh, these fence looking things around whatever the heck that is, which I don't think that's a footer, but then over here, I don't know, maybe it's just something to hold that thing in place until they actually start pouring cement, which I just said there was a cement truck with like a missile area like a couple hours ago, but I don't know what this is all for. All I know is uh, construction is definitely coming along quickly for this one. I'll go a little bit more of the experts to get a better view of what's going on over there. And also, I wonder what's up uh, over there near the turnout of the station of the boss. So let's go take a look. Up on the exit bridge now, and those little pegs that are sticking out of the footer, I think those are going to be for the supports on the track. Because if you look at the pegs right here, they're like sticking upwards a little bit. And some of the track pieces over there have like what look to be holes in them. And something tells me those are going to be for those pegs or whatnot. I don't know if that's the right thing, right to recall, but maybe some nuts or bolts or whatever it is. Uh, I think the track will be going on those supports inside of those little bolts or whatever. Like I said, I don't know what those are, but yeah, that is telling me that this might be part of the coaster's layout. And over there, I'm not sure what that is. Actually, I think I know what that is, but let's go take a look. I am pretty sure that this is for the station over here because all those footers surrounding those other ones with the blue bolts or whatever. I think that's gonna be for some of the track. And that white thing down there in the middle where I'm zoning in at, it looks like that might be some type of control panel. Maybe. I'm just probably guessing at this point, but I'm talking about way over, I don't know, like right where I'm pointing at down there. That thing in the center there is what I'm trying to figure out. Uh, I don't know, I think this might be station stuff and I uh, got Mr. Freeze going right there but that's not important for this but yeah I think if I had to guess this is going to be for station now for the Q house I am honestly not sure how they're going to do that unless they make it so it runs from over near where Dragon's Wings entrance used to be all the way over to here so I don't know I'm really interested to see where this is all going and uh I don't know. Let's see what they got here. Yeah, those are more footers. I think we're looking at some type of track thing. Well, some sections for the track for all the blue things, all the blue footers and the other things over there. I think we're looking at station stuff. So, yeah, that, that's my guess as to what everything could be. Now, I could be totally wrong about this. So, I'll also be checking back frequently. And uh, whatever I'm not at this park, I'll have Ellis keep sending him updates for the channel so that way you guys can stay following along with Rookie Racer. One more thing before I end out this construction update. It looks to me that this all down here is for, I think, uh, cutting wood and whatnot because it looks like we have some tools down there and we got a huge stack of wood over there. Mm -hmm. So I think that might be where they're doing all the cutting for all the station and stuff and they may, they may be bringing it to over here if I had to guess. But I don't know, also these footers, I think nothing has really changed about those yet. But what I wouldn't be surprised about is if uh, there's a bridge that goes over the train tracks. That might be why these are elevated over here, actually. I just realized that. Oh, actually, yeah, I realized that some of them are probably for track, but I have no idea, honestly, where this could go. I can see it going in. I mean, unless there's a queue house that runs right alongside here, I highly doubt that's the case, but I don't know. Oh, well, I guess that'll be it for this Rocky Race construction update. And before we click off this video, please be sure to leave, leave a like if you haven't done so already, and be sure to comment what you enjoyed about this video. Be sure to share it with someone else you may know. If you're new to the channel like what you saw, please consider subscribing for more Rookie Racer updates and other content like this. My goal is to hit 500 subscribers by the end of summer, so I'd appreciate you subscribing and turn on the bell so you get notified every time I upload a new video. I also have an Instagram account for the pictures I take whenever I visit a park, so be sure to check me out there as well via the link in the description. Thanks guys again for watching, and I'll see you later.